Okay, you might be fooling now, Koba. Once again, Emirates TV, West TV. So, first time here, but my name is subscribe to channel now. The am I on a book? Kennedy, a compare con a Japan, Eden Simbi, Abetuia. But I think that Ghana for a general answer and course are in same way. So, before I say, and I said, after say MP before, I got to about the flag bearer, and I said, I got to about a demand bomber as well. No, and a year MPB flag bearer. Kennedy a Japan a ko granti interview bi e wo e ye KSM ni show ne e so. Na e no, ana Kennedy e din se mbi e ko tu e jow ho. But there some issues bi a Kennedy a Japan iti mi e address e ya. I think se gana po a jone a anse da an kwa jwapa na e bi emu no. O sa an so e ko e ye ko jo se odin ni show ne so a mwa no so e ko kan se mbi on ma. I think se gana po a jone a anse da an kwa tu ye. Now, after se elections no e ba na se after se primaries no e ba aso no. Kennedy a Japan e ka jisi no. He is focusing on e promoting on ni business and I feel how obit me a create more employment for the youth in this country. And obit devote more of his time no on any business so. And he is not not that say he is quitting a politics but as a CC no obey jai politics now to longer cry as a non weapon for more than say or obey focusing on any business no so so what in some every it me at you and a bimino or some so I address it on how obey campaign for Baumia and I say NP before end if say obey campaign for Baumia and Yama obey and I feel so on campaign for Baumia and also no and Yama obey Kennedy Japan and in some every at you I was young with Tisa and seven a reba there are some issues we are a bear by dressing at the amount I I think that Kennedy at Japan is doing a low key campaign on uh, uh, Japan a uh, low key campaign ahead of 2028 elections. Because since so, you know MPP stands 50% chance to win these elections, and I feel almost also standing a 50% chance of losing elections. So there are some uh, Kennedy Japan, I would say he has a chance of becoming MPP flag bearer beam if say MPP for. Elusive this particular elections now. So, your papa san semi now so near didn't you munchy mo at me abro. So, young putin sama can ya pon a kaye. Oh, KSM shows a says, you know, he's focusing on promoting his business than say obe campaign for MP before and I say, or then who ever drum Ghana politics mo. With all this fire, with all these ideas that you're coming up with, you know, pragmatic ideas that you believe that this is the path Ghana should be on. Are you sure we have seen the last of you? Like, uh, you know, that we are now sitting back now to, to help where possible? Or are we going to see another emergence of, should I say, the showdown man? <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you very much. Um, I think uh, at the moment what I'm doing is uh, I have to promote my business. So that I can create more employment for the youth of this country. So I will devote more time on my business. It doesn't mean I'm not going to do politics. Even if you are doing politics, you still need money. This time, everything is money. So if you don't work, how will you get the money if you don't? I don't want to be a contestant where I'll be going everywhere, begging, begging, begging. I have to make sure I have the seed money for whatever I'm doing so that people will look at what I have done or I'm doing and have confidence to also contribute. And if you can do that, then it's all business. So currently, I mean, I have a peace of mind, you know, to do my business, just that is also setting me thinking, go, I'm aspiring to get to, you know, higher pay in life. And when you go to meetings and you hear people speaking, investors, then it's like in a blind man's world, one eye man is a king. Can a Japan is here everywhere you go? Can a Japan? Can a Japan? When you go to big big meetings the people the minds and the ideas that they have in a japan you are just a small fry so i come back it sets me thinking how am i going to get there and that's how i dream big it, and challenge myself so currently i want to concentrate on my business it doesn't mean i'm not going to campaign i will be there 
but it's not the same as you being the candidate and going around everywhere. If you always listen to me, I've always preached unity and peace in the party. But if you want unity in the party, if you want peace in the party, there should be fairness. That is all I've been preaching. That there should be fairness. There should be fairness. But unfortunately, this campaign is like Plato's ideal world, where justice is in the interest of the strongest. And this is not Plato's world. One group will come out with all sorts of things. The party, nobody hears them. Can a Japan goes out there to respond to allegations, hey, the whole world, which is very, very unfair. Look at what they did to Alan. Now he's gone. If I have offended anybody, I apologize. And now when they also apologize, accept it. So we, then we move. Has to pass it through. Yeah, you apologize. They apologize. Yeah, they have to. If they apologize. don't, apologize. But if you don't, it's up to you. Yeah, if you don't, it's up to you. You will come yourself. If you don't come, we'll leave you behind. Because we need to change this country. They are not going to, you know, pampas sicko fans. No, I won't do it. I'm not going to pamper single fans. We have to move this country. We have to develop this country. We cannot allow all these lands at the five northern regions, Afram Plains, Volta region, to lie undeveloped. My brother, industrial revolution. If you vote for Canada Japan, industrial revolution. That is the only way we can move this country. Technology. Huh? We're going to build a whole technology city, smart city, you know, for these young men. They, they are technocrats. They can do a lot of things, but there's no push. We have to push talented people like that. Engineering. Look, when Ghanaians go outside, they excel. Why is it that they don't? When they are here. Enabling environment. That is what is happening. Recently, there was this conversation about the contestants of the National Science of Mass where people, where someone said, said, all these brilliant minds, they would finish the senior high school and leave the country and just go to the US, UK, wherever they want to go, and they will never come back. Yes, it's true. Let me tell you. Last month, we went to Kent USD, and the lecturers were complaining that their best students from first degree, they've all gotten scholarships to do PhD straight without masters, and they've all gone. They've left. And when they go, these white people, they are smart. When they see that, look, this chap is brilliant, they just hold you tight. By holding them tight, we are losing them. They will never come back. That's the challenge. So I will make sure. And it's all because the chemistry department, tech, they showed me an incubator one boy has designed. Can break the eggs about 4,000 a day. And it costs only 30,000 cities. Nobody out there to promote. Now, these people, we have to get them and promote them. You know, support them so that they can expand. Another challenge we have here is that there's a gap between the industries or the ministries and the universities. We have to bring them together. The universities and the ministries and the industries, the companies in this country, should be working together. So, so the latest development and all those things, they share. Here, they are far apart. All these things we need to bring together, especially CSIR. You know, the cattle, you know, our produce. You know, we need a lot of scientific aid that will boost the economy. Vote for a man who will create employment, job opportunities for them, for life. Don't go and take money that within a month you spend it and come back again to your, your lifestyle, yeah. which is poverty. Let them compare messages from all the aspirants and choose the one who has a message that will help the future and develop this country. Thank you very much. I hope 
you will say everything that I've said everything. as it is. Everything is going out. You know, because that sometimes no. the way you guys be we, 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 I, I watched <laughs> I, I mean about six of your interviews and you were you were always saying the media will destroy <laughs> Yeah, they will destroy the country. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Because the example is when I went to Yana, mm. one radio station reported that oh the way Yana lambasted me mm. and everything. It was never true mm. until his office mm. issued a, a statement. Sta a statement. So the media has not been fair to you. Well, but I will always speak the truth. Have you been fair to the media, though? Yes. Okay. Very, very fair. Mm. Because I own media, so why not? But it doesn't mean that if what you are saying is not true, mm. I should allow it to pass. Thank you very much for for this interview. We do appreciate, and God bless you. Thank you. Good